Yo, how's it going ladies and gentlemen? I hope it's going good. I'm not going to be talking about the gameplay in this video. This is going to be a little bit more of a serious commentary. Uh, you know, it shouldn't be very upsetting. You know, I don't... I'll try to make it not, you know, upsetting or anything like that. And, uh, you know, there's just uh, a lot of things been going through my mind right now. This is just YouTube and people don't seem to understand that. You know, they want to get internet famous or YouTube famous and stuff like that. They're, they're really in it for the money and stuff and they... They change their personalities if you you know play with somebody or if you've experienced different you know types of communication with them instead of just watching their commentaries you'll notice that people are really fake in this community and that's something I strive not to be I strive to be you know as real as possible I try to keep it 100 and uh, there's very few commentators or youtubers out there that I respect for you know staying real to themselves and not trying to please a certain type of audience throughout YouTube and I just, uh, I don't really know why this is on my mind. I've just been thinking about it. I, you know, I, I tweet people and stuff, ask them to check out my videos and stuff like that. I've never asked anybody for a shout out. I've never asked anybody to do a dual com except for people that like me. Or at least I hope, I, I don't even hope they like me because I don't give a shit if they don't. But I, um, I think they like me, you know, I think they enjoy my content. And I enjoy theirs as well. Those are the only people I've ever asked to do a dual commentary with. You know, if somebody's like, I need a gameplay, or I want to upload a good gameplay or a video of one of my subscribers, I'll tweet them a video, but I don't, I've never been a person to, you know, ask people for something that I don't think I deserve, or just, you know, go out of my way to uh, try to get something from somebody who doesn't necessarily have to give me anything in return. And don't get me wrong, if anybody offers me something, like a dual commentary or a shout out or something like that, I'll probably accept it. But I'm not gonna be asking for it. I'm not. I'm gonna not. I'm not gonna tweet anybody, asking them to check out my videos anymore. I'm just gonna, you know, upload a video, and uh, you know that's gonna be it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna upload the video. I'm gonna let you all watch it. I'm gonna reply to all the comments on the video because that's what I do. You know, I try to interact with my subscribers somehow. And I was playing with a subscriber today from the UK, and uh, what he messaged or we were talking, you know, and he said uh, this is exactly what he said. You know, it might not be quote for quote, but this is basically what he said. He said, "You're the only commentator I've ever played with that sounds exactly like he does when he plays in his commentaries." And uh, you know, that's what I try to be. You know, sometimes like this commentary is a little bit different than most of my commentaries because I try to have fun, try to be enthusiastic because that's the mood that I'm usually in when I make these videos. But right now I'm just in a completely different mood and I just really wanted to express my feelings and my opinion, you know, on this subject is just, I hate seeing, you know, these fake ass commentators, these fake ass people. It, it really makes me mad and I just want to let you all know, you know, I keep it real. I'm going to be that way forever and, uh, you know, if you enjoy these videos, that's all I can ask for you know making a few dollars I don't even know how much money I'm gonna make it doesn't it doesn't fucking matter you know no it doesn't nothing matters this is just YouTube and people don't seem to understand that they really just wanna get big on YouTube make a lot of money and you know whatever I don't I don't care about that that's not real life there's so much shit has happened to me in real life man it's fucking ridiculous. I, I've almost died myself. I basically was put into cardiac arrest. Or not put in, but I basically I was, you know, had cardiac arrest. I was diagnosed with a heart condition. You know, I'm good health, 18 years old. And I, I have a fucked up heart condition. You know, I, I've seen my mom almost die twice. One from a really bad car accident. One, she, I don't know, she had a stroke or something like that. And it was right in front of my eyes. And I've had guns pulled on me. I've had guns shot at me. And it, it's just... I just try to keep it real, and when I see people that try to act, you know, whatever, however they act, they try to act super happy, super enthusiastic, they try to, you know, of course they're just trying to entertain you all, but they're not keeping, they're not being real to themselves, and, uh, you know, before you can be real to yourself, you gotta be real to everybody else, and, uh, you know, that's just the way I feel about it, this commentary, if you didn't like this commentary, whatever, if you don't like my videos, just unsubscribe doesn't, you know, like I said, it doesn't bother me, I do this as a hobby, I'm doing this for fun, I'm if you all enjoy it then I couldn't ask I couldn't ask for anything more and uh, you know that's that's basically all I gotta say sorry if this video is a little bit fucking weird but I just I'm just gonna try to keep it real you know that's all I gotta say alright peace the fuck out everybody